five bizarre sexual customs from around the world, sexuality is a universal human experience, but how it's expressed varies wildly across cultures. From shared wives to shocking initiation rituals, here are five strange sexual customs from different corners of the globe that will leave you amazed. 1. Brothers sharing a wife, Nepal. In the remote Himalayan regions of Nepal, one wife isn't just for one man, it's for the whole family. Yes, brothers here traditionally share a single wife. Why? It's not just about tradition, it's practical. Scarce agricultural land and limited resources make it difficult to support multiple households. This custom ensures family unity and resource preservation. But it's not all about survival. Sharing a wife also means that no brother is left unmarried or abandoned. It's a cultural take on love, relationships, and survival in one of the world's most rugged terrains, too. From boy to man, the Sambia of Papua New Guinea, in Papua New Guinea, boys undergo extreme rituals to become men. At age 7, they leave their mothers to live exclusively with men in the community. The reason? To rid themselves of what the culture sees as female pollution, the journey to manhood involves painful rituals like skin cutting and piercing. These practices are thought to purify the boys, removing any lingering connection to their mothers or femininity. It's a process rooted in both superstition and traditions, shaping the Sambia's idea of masculinity. 3. Painful purity. The Martijara aboriginals of Australia, the Martijara people of Australia have a shocking initiation ritual for young men. It begins with circumcision, done using primitive tools, making the process excruciating. But it doesn't end there, after healing, a second cut is made along the underside of the penis, and the flowing blood is ceremoniously thrown into the fire. Why endure such pain? The community believes it purifies the young men, marking their transition to adulthood. In a final twist, the initiates are required to eat their own foreskin, a ritual that symbolizes consuming their past and embracing their new identity. 4. Public rituals at Sot Domo Waterfall, Haiti, in Haiti, where voodoo traditions remain strong, the Sot Domo Waterfall is the site of an annual festival that blends spirituality and sexuality. Participants strip naked and engage in public rituals, including intimate acts between couples. The festival is believed to cleanse participants and strengthen their spiritual connection to the gods. For the locals, this isn't just an act of faith. It's a celebration of life, fertility, and community. 5. A bride for the whole family, Diana, in Diana, some communities practice a custom that might leave outsiders in shock. After the wedding, the bride isn't just her husband's partner, she's shared among the groom's male relatives. This custom continues until the bride gives birth to her first child. According to tradition, childbirth signifies that the wife officially belongs to her husband. While controversial, this practice is deeply rooted in cultural beliefs about family bonds and community relationships. What can we learn? These traditions may seem shocking or bizarre to outsiders but they reflect how different societies adapt to their environments. Beliefs and resources. Sexual customs, no matter how unconventional, offer insights into the values and struggles of a community. What do you think about these customs? Share your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more fascinating insights from around the world.